to the world is here to stay. Do you believe in that? Oh, absolutely. You know, I was so happy the way you said, what am I? <laughs> she watches them all the time. Oh, I'm in China, so for the black man speaking Chinese. <laughs> I was like, yo, I need to do a video with you. And we actually met in one Africa. Yes, absolutely. One Africa. Let me give hug you again. Oh, love it. Hey. <laughs> you know, if you're watching my videos and I say it's a year of hug, right? So, yes, a year of return and a year of hug. Yes. A year of fire. That energy. No, you look so happy. Thank you. I Yesterday, that. like you're not even happy, you're so excited. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Yes, yes. How long have you been in Ghana? I've been here since the 29th of August of this year. This year? Yes, sir. Are you you moved to Ghana or are you just visiting? Moved to Ghana. I'm moved. here permanently, yes sir. Permanently. Yes, sir. Have you been here before? Yes sir, I have. When was that? Uh, first time was 2009. Okay. Then the second time, 2014. And then 2019? Year of return. Year of return. Yes sir. Why Ghana? Because, well, um, according to my family DNA testing, mm -hmm. it led back here to Ghana. Okay, the Ashanti people. The Ashanti people. Yes, sir. So that's why Ghana. You moved from America? Yes, sir. To Ghana. Mm -hmm. You left your family there? You came with your family? Yes, I can leave my family to come to Africa. You, you, you left your family in America? Yes, sir. And then moved to... You're not scared of coming to Africa? No, absolutely not. You know, what are the things that you heard about Africa before uh, taking your first visit? What was, the first, what was the things that you heard about the Africa? The main thing I heard as a kid growing up, well, a child growing up, was African booty scratching. Okay. Uh, um, go back to Africa. Well, this is what the white folk folks told. Go back to Africa, nigga, where you come from. Okay. Um, I heard so many negative things about Africa that we were savages, that we were monkeys and trees and all that kind of stuff, right? And um, they showed us pictures and films of Africa with Tarzan being the king of the jungle, riding elephants, and he had to tame the, the black African savages. You know, those are the things that I heard yeah. before I came. And you are, in, you are in Ghana right now? I'm in Ghana right now. Do you now. see those things that you saw before? It was a bunch of lies. A bunch of lies. They lied to you. They lied to me. They lied to us. us. Okay, people in the US and wherever else in the diaspora, they lied to us. Okay? Come to find out Africa is the motherland. Africa is the heartbeat of the planet Earth. All right? Without Africa, no other country or continent on the planet Earth will be able to survive. If the, all the African governments on the continent of Africa close their doors to all the rest of the governments of the world, they will die. Simply as that. They will die. Okay? Why do you think China is over here? America, Europe, everybody's scrambling over this here precious Heart of the beat, what you uh, 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 paradise, Africa. All right, because well, Africa has so much to offer the world. Well, Absolutely, we well, would die if they cut us off. Well, well I won't say us because I'm part of Africa, Africa now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I love Africa. Wow, well, I'm glad that you love Africa. Mm -hmm. I love you too. Like, Thank you know, you, you need to, you need to send up me. I'm always happy to meet African Americans. I'm, I'm always happy to meet the African diaspora. Ooh, I'm Africa. Like I, I always want to hear your story because I met a lot of people in China that were telling me I'm not African, don't call me African. So mm -hmm. seeing you, seeing yourself an African, so happy. I hope you get your Ghana passport soon. Do you have a passport yet? No, sir, I don't. But do you soon have your passport? I hope so. I hope Ghana would do they, that for me. They, they will surely do that for mm -hmm. you. Just yes, um, you, you're gonna stay here. You're gonna add value to mm -hmm. things that we're gonna do. So definitely they're gonna give you the passport. But I want you to say something. What is the message you're gonna tell people out there? Your brothers and sisters, your, you know, your daughters, your children, who think that I'm not going to Africa. Africa is not a place for me. Is there any message that you have for people like that? Yes, absolutely. Africa is for you. Why be in the place where you're not wanted? We're not wanted there in the United States of America. And I'm not, I, and I am not lying. History says so. History will verify what I am saying if you would do the research, okay? Um, they told us that Africa was full of diseases, uh, dying children, and they would show us those negative images of Africa, okay? But Africa is a beautiful place. Africa is a place of healing. Africa is where everybody else come to to get the herbs to heal themselves, okay? To take it back to America and places like that and make medicine all right to, to uh, heal their people which they really don't heal them, all right but the herbs here on this continent will heal your body come to Africa relax 
This is a place of peace. They always show us war and tribal wars and all that kind of stuff. Don't believe the hype. All right. I mean, it's just a small minute, but they, they're not the one that Africans is not the one that's causing the tribal war. It's the outside people that's coming in that's causing the problem. Not us. We are peaceful people by nature. OK, we're loving, kind, peaceful people by nature. So come on home. I'm telling my children, come home. This is where I'm at. Do you want to see your mama again? You better come to Africa straight up. OK, because I did the right thing that was for me, that, that my ancestors was calling me to do is to leave out of the belly of the beast and come home to paradise, the Garden of Eden, which is Africa. 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 Come home. One come Straight home. up. One come home. Thank you. Man. I talked to your daughter yesterday, yes. and I can't wait to see your daughter too back in Africa. Mm -hmm. You know, home is calling. Mm -hmm. Ancestors are calling you yes, all. That's right. Come and enjoy home because, like, I don't know what to say right now. I have no idea how you made me feel yesterday. Uh, and I was like, you. I need to come back today, meet you, do a video with mm -hmm. you so that you can also share your message. Yes. You know, seeing people watch your videos coming mm -hmm. back. I want to say I love you so much. I love you too. Girl, I love you so much. Oh. Yes. Mm. <laughs> wow. I love the positive energy. energy. Wow. Yes, and that's what you um, sent out oh, there, yes. that positive energy vibe there. And it, and it reached out to me. You know, I said, look at this brother. Because I was following you for a long time. Wow. But maybe about a year or two. Okay, and then I watch you as you grow and, and develop and mature, you know. And I said, I've got to meet this brother one day, and uh, I am. And then when you start talking about Africa to the world, uh, like, boy, you was a hit <laughs> straight up. <laughs> I just want to know do, do the people in here, how do they treat you in Africa? Yeah, in Africa, they treat me great. They call me mommy, madame, uh, auntie, they love me. They love you. They love you. That's me. what yes. I've been telling you. I love you too. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. And I love you too. Wow. Yes. Yeah, it's wow. awesome. Uh, because what I, what I heard was that um, African Americans are moving back to Ghana or moving back to Africa. Like we're not gonna like them because we sold them, and that because of that reason, we're not gonna like you. So I always want to hear from mm -hmm. those who have already been here. Yeah. Like you know, we can't tell. Mm. That's something that another people have put in our people here to keep them from coming in. Wow. from us coming together because they know when we're together we're like a mighty power they say when the black man wake up it's all open straight up meaning that the uh the self-hate and we want to bleach our skins mm -hmm. and and get contact lenses and get blonde hair and and try to look like other than who we are all right when we wake up to who we really are it's over, over. straight up but these people here love me and they, these people here love those people out there mm. in, in the U.S. Because when I first came here uh, back in 2009, mm. uh, the Ghanaian brothers and sisters was telling me to send messages to them. Come home. We love you. You know? And that slave thing was a setup by another people. All right? It was designed. Oh. You know, it was trickery. You know, trickology. Yeah. You know, to do what happened to our people that we were taken away from here and sent to America, yeah. Europe, and all over the other places, yeah. it was a straight setup, you know? So the, the people here that know about it is so heartfelt and feel sorry, you know? So don't let it be a divide. They welcome us home. They love us. Straight up, I'm not lying. It's the truth. You know what? I, I want to do this for you. Do you have a YouTube channel? Yes, sir, I do. Mm -hmm. what, what do you talk about on your channel? Uh, any and everything. Family, my children, my travel. You know what? I, I really want people to enjoy your journey in mm -hmm. Ghana. Yes, sir. So I want people to come and follow your channel. Yes, so sir. all you need to do is to get ready for me. <laughs> like Because they are going to come in their numbers. Yes, sir. And uh, when they come in their numbers, you have to feed them for me. Yes, about sir. what you do every day, what goes on in Accra, Ghana, mm -hmm. Cape Coast, wherever you go. Please, make sure you show them so that... From your journey, mm -hmm. they will also repatriate and yes, come sir. and join you. Absolutely. So please, I'm just mm -hmm. asking you. I know you, you don't really have time to be a YouTuber, mm -hmm. but I want to ask you, please, can you be a YouTuber just for mm -hmm. us? You know what? My daughter asked me that the same thing, to uh -huh. be a YouTuber. <laughs> yes. And I've been stalling for a whole year. Mm -hmm. But now since you asked me, I've been invited by a genuine, famous YouTuber. Uh, no. Not that I'm uh, <laughs> this, you know, Throwing away uh, uh, yeah. my daughter's request, yeah. but you're verifying what yeah. she's saying that okay. I should do. Okay. Yeah. So, Good. Yes, so sir, um, you know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna put her YouTube 
channel link in the description go subscribe go tell her that what amaya said we should come and subscribe and make sure you feed us with content from accra ghana cape coast ghana wherever you're gonna see yourself in ghana please let us know where you are yes, thank sir, you so absolutely. much for talking to me oh you're welcome oh, I come on, I get another hug. <laughs> <laughs> that energy piece that is energy. yes sir absolutely wow.